what's going on you guys welcome back to another quick video now before we get into the video of reviewing wonder shield for more x the lifetime version i do want to apologize for how long i've been gone i know i've been gone for a fat minute and i do highly apologize i've been just getting everything for the car that i have ready for car shows and stuff like that making sure that i have all the camera stuff and the accessories and the road mic and all that stuff is working properly now i am working on basically you know work and learning how to use this so i'm still new at this but i figured out how to pack some stuff down so if you want to make great videos or even clips of videos put together to look great i'm going to show you guys how to do it and if you don't believe me here's one that i use with my own video using a small sample video as well As you guys can see, I am not done making this, but that was just a small intro I made using a basic clip of me in somebody's backyard, and I used some of the photos and clipped it and cut it and put a few things in there. Now, guys, if you like that, you can make stuff too just like that with Femora X, so stay tuned, and I'm going to basically show you how to add those cut, cut, well, those cut type videos together. So first thing is first, this is the cut thing and also the, the review button, or you can use this one right here. Um, but I highly recommend just using this. It's a little bit easier. And if you have to cut something, all you have to do is find that part you want to cut and then cut it. So basically, we're going to be using this, some audio. So let's find a quick little bit of audio in the downloads and let's find one. Let's see what would sound good. I think that sounds good so we're gonna go there go back to the media the sample video unless you're using your own videos you can follow this tutorial just a little bit so basically we're gonna take a look at the video audio and this together to see if it goes together okay so so far it's going pretty well so as you can see, they're there. So we're going to just put this in here to make it seem a little bit more, you know, realistic. So we're going to play it back one more time. And you're basically going to keep going back until you find the good clips and they all match perfectly and line up together. Because in reality, you want that to kind of basically have that momentum like you're really there. Okay, so we're going to add this and see if that adds. I don't know if it's going to look good, but if it looks good, then we'll leave that and go to something else. So we're going to just leave a small little bit of darkness and I'll show you guys why in a second. We're just going to match it up because I want something to show and look very professional. You'll see what I'm talking about. So you see what I'm trying to do now, guys. So you're just going to find where that bass drops again, which is right there. And we're going to basically have this one like right here. And we're going to take a look at it again. 
Like I said, guys, perfection is key when editing a video or making clips like this into something in the beginning of your video for any vlog, to be honest. So I highly recommend trying new things and experimenting like what I'm doing at this moment of time. So let's try this one. So you see how we're just a tiny bit off. So we're just going to basically go like this and try to get it even. As much as we can. Okay, that's pretty even. All right, we're going to try it one more time. Alright, so as you guys can see, it's looking pretty good. So we're going to just keep going down and seeing if we can get something that's pretty good. So before we go down, we're just going to make sure it matches up. And it doesn't, so we're going to go a little bit back, like right here, because I believe that's where it is. Now the reason I'm putting this back is because at the end of the day, I want it to be pretty perfect. So I want to make sure that everything's good. Almost. <laughs> We're like literally maybe a point milliliter, like maybe a 0 0.1 second. Okay, I think right here. Is there any blackage? No, there's not. Okay, so we just need a small little bit like right there. Perfect. All right, now let's test it. And we probably have one more bass drop and then we'll add it back and we'll basically repeat the same you know the same thing or you can add other things part of the video it all depends on how you feel of editing a video So as you guys can see, it's basically coming together perfectly. And I believe right there is the video right here. Let's let's see. Perfect. OK. So now we're going to start adding some transitions if you want. I'm not going to do that at this moment in time. If you want more of a deep like me editing videos or my own videos, just let me know down in the comments below. Right now, I'm not going to make a huge video. So we're just going to go back to effects so we can get a crisp, a clear video of basically what we're going to be using. So this right here looks kind of good. There's multiple, multiple. There's like over 500 right here. There's AI portraits. I don't even know what these are, but I mean, they're, they're pretty cool, I guess. This is the human glitch. I don't even know if I have this unlocked, but uh, yeah. So the only thing with Wondershare for more X is these diamonds mean you can't use it. And I don't think you can use this either without buying it. So we're not going to show you that because I'm going to be showing you what you can do with what you purchased. So, yeah. So we have this and I don't know what this looks like. So I think this would look good on something else, but we're not going to use that. So I think, let's see. This right here is really beautiful. So I think that we're going to add like something like this. So the background of that really pops out. And then right here, I feel like this effect right here would be perfect. So we're going to add this type of effect just to this only. And we're going to see what that looks like with it all together. Now, 
the reason that we're skipping things is you don't want too much in you know a video you want it to be pretty perfect you don't want like too much of something so i really recommend you know making sure that when you're posting a video you have just what you need added to it because at the end of the day you know you want something that's perfect you don't want something that's trash so highly recommend taking your time and really going through what you guys think is perfect you know what i think is perfect could be trash for you but this is just a quick video of editing stuff so it's not something that i do mostly so i think this would be nice too with like a distortion in the middle so we're gonna add that right here and then we're gonna just take that and basically make it like that and let's see <laughs> Now, right here, it would be finally cool, too. You know, just have it, like, right here for a quick second. And then, yeah, let's see. Let's take a look. Then right here as well. And now, why I'm causing it, like right in these areas is so I can get this perfectly matched with the music. Because you want something crazy when the beat drops. So you want to have something decent when you're editing. And you know, it all is in how you edit something. Like for example, this is going with the beat, this is going with the edits, and everything will add up over time. You see what I'm saying? Now I did see an error right here. Somewhere. And let me just make sure that it's just my imagination playing tricks on me. Okay, so this needs to go just a tiny bit more. That's what the issue was. Okay. Let's see if that fixed the issue. Okay, so right there we have added pretty much a nice little effect. So I want to add a little bit of color film to this part right here i think that this will be beautiful the whole way through so let's take a look also we're going to be adding something else so before we do that let's okay let's see <laughs> So as you guys can see, it's trial and error to make sure everything is lining up perfectly and getting everything situated. Now, in today's video, I'm going to be showing you just a tiny bit of stuff, nothing too crazy. But I hope you guys understand basically the just of how to add a certain effect to a certain cut and a certain effect and a certain way to do it with specific videos like this is more like vlog footage. So like in the beginning of your video, you could use it just like this and I feel like it would look a lot more professional than most people's videos. Now guys, if you want me to help you make videos or you need me to help you, all you have to do is go to my Instagram at Jojo Finessing and basically message me saying, hey, could you help me? And I will be gladly to help you guys take some time if I have the time to go through this with you. Now I'm not gonna do it for you because why? Because I just don't have time, but I will help you guys understand this a little bit better. So the final product we're going to show you guys, it's not really the final for me. I would like to do a little bit more, but we're running out of time. So let me show you guys the final thing. All right, 
I lied to you guys. I'm actually going to extend this because of that issue. I really just don't like that. So we're going to extend that issue to right here. I just didn't like it. All right. So one more time, guys. Sorry. So guys, that was basically the final rough draft copy of editing a video and making it the way it is now. I hope you guys understand a little bit better how to use it and the things you can do with Filmora. I really understand, you know, a lot of people have issues, but sometimes if you get something like this that can basically give you formats that you can just drag and drop, I feel like it's a little bit simpler for people. So guys, I love you guys so much. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.